G'day everyone. I've been asked a few times lately if I could just run through my fly fishing gear and show you what I use when I'm fly fishing. So here's a really short video just to show you. I have got, this is my trout fly rod. It's a Wildfish Cascade Series 4 weight 7 foot 6 rod. It's a four piece, it's a travel rod. It's absolutely brilliant. It's one of the nicest rods I've ever cast a fly with. Four weight is a great all rounder. It's not too big in the small streams and it's not too small in the big streams. If you're in a really big river, ideally you might want a six or a seven weight even to cast way out further, but then you probably won't be able to use that in a small stream. Whereas a four weight is quite versatile. It's a bit of an all-rounder. So it's a four weight Wildfish Cascade series with Cortland 444 forward weighted line, and the line is five weight. I always like to have the line one weight class higher than the rod. I find that just helps cast quite a bit better. And right beside it here, this is my cod fly fishing outfit, which I started doing this summer and had a lot of fun. And I'm already looking forward to next summer so I can do it again. This is a Reddington Crosswater. It's also a four piece. It's a travel rod. It's an eight weight. And eight weights right on about the minimum for, tr for cod. Although I did fish with my good friend, Mick Harron from Mountain Fly Vic a while back. And I think Mick was using a six or a seven weight or something. That's okay if you're tossing small flies and, and catching small fish. But if you hook a big one, you're going to get into trouble. And to be quite honest, even with this Reddington 8 weight, if I hook a big one, I'm probably still going to get into trouble. <laughs> but I did get one. I've got two. I've got a trout cod and a Murray cod, both around 60 centimetres. I'll share the link in the video above now so that you can see it. But that was caught on this, the Reddington Crosswater. I'll bring it up closer so you can see that. This is a ripper. There it is. Reddington Crosswater. Fantastic combo. Now this is an eight weight rod. This has got nine weight pike musky line on it. It's nice and strong. It's forward tapered, so it's forward weighted, sorry, so that it can cast better. And I'm only just using 30 pound uh, monofilament for the lead. I think I'm using Maxima Ultra Green. And the fly I've got on here was tied for me by Pitt Clements. It's called a Pitty Monster, and they are great flies. Now just a quick one with the leader, because I was new to cod fishing and me being me, I didn't do a lot of research, I just went out and started fishing. I started off with a six pound leader chasing cod. What do you think happened with the first cod I hooked? Got him, snap. <laughs> also I learned there and then the, and other people helped me out online. You don't strike, you just strip strike, you pull the line through to set the hook. But it was a fun learning experience. I had a blast, I lost five in a row one night and I still laughed them all off. But there you go, folks. Reddington Crosswater 8 weight. So I, when I go fly fishing, I've got a couple of old uh, Jay and Gilly special or something floating around here that I don't use anymore. It was my brother-in-law's, my late brother-in-law's. But then my main fly rods, my main artillery when I go fly fishing. Wild Fish Cascade Series 4 weight with a 5 weight Cortland 444 forward weighted line for trout fishing. Reddington 8 weight. Four piece with the nine weight pike musky line for Murray cod fishing. I hope this helps. Thank you to those few of you that have been asking me to talk about my fly fishing gear. I hope that answers all your questions.